suicide by food food is killing us softly the vast majority of people subconsciously dress up emotional pain with weight gain food is used therapeutically and instead of getting to the root of the issue overeating and eating the wrong kinds of food which we call pleasure food but in fact it's actually pain food this type of eating only provides temporary relief but damaging long-term consequences it is very important to understand what triggers disease so as to treat the cause cancer happens when the cells in the body start multiplying unusually this starts when a disparity is present in the body's interior environment specifically the ph usually the body's ph is between 7.35 and 7.45 this represents an optimal alkaline environment when an unhealthy lifestyle causes ph to decrease resulting in a state referred to as acidosis it indicates the body contains excessive acid this expansion is really what causes the creation of disease and cancer the cure should target the reversal of this acidosis state by restoring the body's ph to optimal alkaline levels ph or potential of hydrogen gauges a liquid's alkalinity or acidity the measurement of ph is carried out on a 0 to 14 scale if a solution has low ph the acidity is higher and if the ph is high the alkaline or base is higher in the solution. The blood's pH is 7.4 when a body is in good physical state. The urine's pH is 7.4 and the saliva's pH is 7.4. Particular sections of the body need to be extra acidic compared to others. For instance the stomach. Other sections require being more alkaline inclined. When using pH paper strips to analyze saliva or urine, target a rate of 7.4. Digestion in the body. The foods which we consume are digested and broken down into a final product, which may either be acidic or alkaline in our tissues. This final product is referred to as the ash and forms a remnant inside the body following the breakdown of food. Foods which present an alkaline ash are referred to as alkaline forming foods while the ones presenting acid ash are referred to as acid forming foods. The body requires these two kinds of foods. But the concentration of alkaline forming foods ought to be higher than foods which create acid. Each person is unique, however, for the majority. The best diet consists of 75% alkaline and 25% acidic foods in terms of volume. Sugars, eggs, meat, dairy, the majority of grains. Carbonated drinks and white flour form acid. Drugs create acid in the body. Synthetic sweeteners such as Equal, NutraSweet or Aspartame are very strong in terms of acid creation. Fresh fruits and vegetables form alkaline to assist your body to generate and sustain a pH equilibrium which is healthy. In general terms, the majority of people have too much acid. This can turn into a harmful state which makes all the systems of the body weak. An internal environment which is more acidic is susceptible to illness like viruses, superbugs, bacteria, inflammation, damage to the immune system and cancer. All these flourish in surroundings which are acidic. A surrounding which is pH balanced however, facilitates standards and healthy workings of the body, essential for fighting illness. When acidic surroundings are present, this compels the body to use the blood's electrolyte minerals like sodium calcium, magnesium and potassium as well as important bones and organs to shield or reduce the acid's effect to ensure safe elimination from the body. Studies indicate that people who consume a lot of soft drinks either with sugar or without are depleting huge quantities of magnesium and calcium as well as other trace minerals so as to mask the acid present in soft drinks there is a danger of getting osteoporosis. 
hypothyroidism, coronary artery illness, high blood pressure and many other debilitating illnesses, including cancer, increases when a lot of minerals are lost. The likelihood of a food to form acid or alkaline inside the body is not related at all to the food's actual pH. For instance, even though limes, grapefruits, and lemons have a chemical composition which are acidic, tests indicate that after being metabolized inside the body, they essentially possess an alkalizing impact and are extremely useful. In the same way, prior to being digested, meat tests as alkaline. However, the deposit it leaves inside the body is extremely acidic. Therefore, similar to almost all products from animals, meat creates acid at a very high rate. Alkalizing fluids in the body or increasing pH is among the one most vital health restoration advantages present as illness causing infection, bacteria, virus, fungi, and cancer cannot exist in an environment which is alkaline oxygenated. Can cancer be cured naturally? Being sick is always distressing to us. Even if it is only a flu virus which will eventually go away. But, terminal and harmful illnesses are a concern to each person following a diagnosis. Being told, I am afraid you have cancer. From a medical practitioner is an experience which is both shocking and emotionally debilitating. Changes in our way of living have given rise to the increase of various cancers, which has led to numerous treatment choices being developed. The standard ones which you will encounter in hospitals are chemotherapy, radiotherapy and surgery. But, their side effects are even more deadly than the actual cancer. However, Mother Nature gives us a method of eliminating this deadly condition by using remedies that occur naturally. Cancer and your current way of life. Similar to hypertension and diabetes. Cancer is a lifestyle illness. There has been an increase in harmful lifestyles leading to more incidents of cancer. The fact that one in three individuals globally has cancer is a cause for concern. Consuming junk food, which is processed. A lack of exercise and an overall careless lifestyle is what facilitates the excessive replication of cancerous cells leading to growths which are tumorous. So, it is vital to make a conscious effort to lead a healthy lifestyle so as to prohibit deadly cancer cell reproduction. In light of this, many nutritionists and herbalists who advocate healing cancer by natural methods suggest using plant extracts. Several varieties of herbs have been recommended and even verified to heal some cancers. Their prospective side effects are not known and their potential effectiveness is still unknown. But a healthy diet and way of life can help to avoid and even heal cancer. Foods and healing. Some foods are available that are able to alleviate cancer cell growth like bananas, apples, grapefruits, cranberries, lemons, oranges, pineapples, garlic, broccoli, kale, spinach, oregano. These can alleviate cancer cell growth. However, not by themselves. If you are searching for a solution by natural methods, you should seek out a reputable herbalist for assistance. It is vital to be aware that red meat makes cancer worse working out regularly, leading a life free from stress, practicing mindfulness, and acquiring sufficient sleep, all contribute to alleviating cancer naturally. Conclusion. A diagnosis of cancer would certainly shock anyone. And due to being distraught, we might take drastic missteps. But, our objective should be acquiring treatments for ourselves which will detoxify our bodies and enhance the immune system with minimal side effects or none at all. Despite whether the methods are natural or conventional, 
For more information just click on the download link in the video description. To secure your copy of my recent book. Diet Desperation Total Transformation. Like, share, comment. To Total Transformation Channel.